We're still continuing our surveillance work um, pretty much around the Coonabarabran area where we call it, I suppose, the epicentre of our locust activity for the Central West. It has spread out from other areas, but that area still remains um, a high level of concentration of egg beds. As of today, we know that about 2% of those have hatched on the recent rain that we had over Easter. And uh, we will continue that monitoring right through for the next couple of weeks because the warmer conditions will certainly promote further hatching and we just need to make sure that we're on top of the situation and can support landholders with delivery of chemical and further advice if it's required in that area. We do know where some egg beds are, but evidence today also shows that uh, we've got laying in that area because the, the recent rain has created uh, pasture growth, fresh green growth, which is very attractive to um, adults and nymph locusts and will further their development um, both in growing from a nymph to an adult but also in egg development of the adults who are still there and there's evidence that um, there's eggs on board and they will continue to lay through the through the winter um, period uh, which will allow those eggs to hatch in the springtime. It's absolutely critical that landholders report that information. Um, doesn't matter how small it is, we do need to know what's happening in those areas so that we're making sure we're meeting the demand with chemical delivery and supply and um, being able to fully assess the situation, particularly with the lead up to spring. As always, the reporting is absolutely essential um, because it's, it's giving us the size of the population we're dealing with. And if this escalates um, outside our scope, then we know that we can call in resources to, to treat it if that's needed. So reporting has to come from the ground, has to come from the landholders. Um, our staff will come out and assess and confirm details and provide the, the, um, the chemical if that's required or the equipment that may be required and further advise as well so just can't bang on enough about how important it is for monitoring by landholders on their own places and reporting back to us.